Yo, what's up Wolfpack? I hope everybody is good. Shout out to every single one of you. I'm going to start this vlog on a positive. I set you guys a challenge to improve the positivity of the comment section and you've absolutely smashed it. We started the Wolfpack because we wanted to have one big family that's positive, helps each other out, interacts, and that is exactly where we're heading now. It was kind of our fault that we let it lead to that, but you guys have turned it around. Shout out to every single one of you for that. You've been amazing. Challenge number two I'm gonna set for you guys is let's get the likes up. So every video you guys watch as the Wolfpack, smash the like button, remember to do so. So on this video, smash the like, comment down below, we'll reply, we'll pin, we'll like, we'll interact, we'll do everything with all the positive comments. I wanted to start this vlog off on a fairly positive note and I feel like I've done that. So, now we can move on, now we can get into what me and Wolf have been up to. I have been telling myself for months that I'm gonna get myself back into a healthy lifestyle and I have yet to do it. However, I have just parked up. I am going to the gym for what seems like an age since the last time I went to the gym. Getting to the gym itself, it's just about time really and time management again isn't one of my strongest points but I do always want to go it's just wherever I've got the time to anyway the more I talk the less gym work I actually do because I've only got an hour so uh, I should probably stop talking get in the gym and actually do some workout or something like that I smashed the gym earlier as you guys saw I'm actually keeping to my healthy eating at the moment I mean I got a prep so there's a crayfish and avocado sandwich there's also a super green salad pot so uh, yeah it's looking fairly healthy I've also got a vitamin volcano I think it's called it's, it's a pink drink and it's meant to be good for you so so far so good Wolf mentioned McDonald's and I held my willpower I don't do that very often so I'm proud of myself hopefully you're proud of me as well um, that'd be great if we could share this achievement. That being said, before I turn into some fitness vlogger or something like that, back to the regular scheduled programming, which is FIFA. We are here in London to go play some FIFA. What else would we be doing? That's kind of what we do. But anyway, Wolf is on his way over. He's got something from MS now, so I'm kind of making him eat healthy a little bit more as well, because as I said, he was going to get a McDonald's, so I'm helping his health as well as my own. Which is always a good thing. 360. Like, I could have got a large big amount of meal for that. But mine was mine was 11 pounds. I'm absolutely spewing. But we won't talk about that. Let's go play some fever. So we're just walking away from Imperial Wharf. We are making our way over to Stamford Bridge. As you saw in the clips, we were at a Roma Chelsea party last night. I've done a few cinematic stuff like that. You know the usual stuff. It is Wolf's birthday today. However, we're not going to talk about that too much because no one really cares, do they? Oh, Sounds like there's a car crash going to go on behind me as well. We are going to Chelsea versus Roma. We're going to do the standard and score predictions. 3-1 Chelsea. That, that's a high scoring game. That would be great if that was true. Chelsea are fairly solid defensively. I feel like Roma's attacking Dzeko aren't going to have enough to break through. I'm going to go for 2-0 Chelsea. Two I nil. think they're going to keep them at bay. And I think Chelsea are going to score a couple past Roma's defence. So I'm going to say 2-0 Chelsea. I say 2-0 against Chelsea. <laughs> <laughs> I love the G7X as a camera. It's so easy to hold. However, in low light situations, the quality goes to absolute <laughs> However, as you can see, I'm doing a good job of pointing that out. We have made it through the front gate, through the stewards. Uh, Wolf has had a bag check. I think he's currently, actually, I'm struggling to point him out. I'm not doing well with that one, but he is also vlogging as well. He's vlogging the experience. We both are as normal. Champions League night, it's always sick. It's always a great atmosphere. I'm looking forward to getting inside, getting to our seats and getting settled in for the game. Guys, I'm not gonna lie to you. Yeah, yeah, uh, this kid's back, it's banging. Like, this is, this is, like, I don't, I don't care what badge you put on this kid, it's banging. Look at that. That is, that's naughty, but do you know what? To go over that, not only are you wearing that, which is banging, you go, oh, let me just, oh. let me just cover it up. 
I'll give you a close look in a second. But the, the levels of that, you catch me in the nightclub. I told you, Chelsea. Chelsea, yeah, yeah, get a picture, man. Wolf is about to say yeah, something. I was about to say, basically, yeah. I told you, we make the best training kits, the best kits. They just look dope. I'd love to. I, I'm gonna get that one day because that is just amazing. I told you, and I mean this with all my heart. I'd wear that in the club if the bouncers would let me pass them, which is normally the problem. But. That is sick. That's a naughty little kit. The blue one's sick as well, white one. I'm changing things. I'm actually just going to change things. So, we are here at the Chelsea versus Stamford Bridge because the reason we are here is to watch the Chelsea versus Roma game. It's Champions League night. As you can see, we've got the Champions League trophy behind me. That's what we're trying to win. But I want to say a massive shout out to Chelsea because in this bag is a nice little birthday present for me, which I'll show you guys when I get home. I don't really want to open it right now. I'll save it when I get home. So, yeah, thank you to Chelsea for the tickets and this present. You guys are awesome. It's time to go watch the game. I was talking about their kits earlier. Now, I'm looking at the camo kit, and in my head I was going to make some standard joke about not being able to see it, but I'm not that type of guy. I'm not going to do it. But. So the game ended 3-3, that's a result which I feel favours Roma a little bit more when it comes to the table anyway however it's not a bad result for Chelsea and also it does mean that well there were three there were six goals in the game which goals are always entertaining although as you said it would have been better for Chelsea to get the three points but on this occasion it isn't going to happen they just have to now get the results against other teams which is going to be a little bit harder but do you know what to to win this tournament you have to beat the best players or the best teams anyway so it's always going to be a task, no matter what, winning the Champions League. There is still a chance, obviously, they're still in with a big chance of topping the group. We're in the middle of the vlog, and this segment probably makes absolutely no sense, but I thought I'd update you guys and say, I'm still on the gym grind. I'm continuing the health grind, I'm doing well, and uh, I've surprised myself, but I'm getting in the lift, I'm going into the gym, and I'm uh, going to do a mixture of cardio and weights. It's not just about pumping iron anymore, it's about being healthy. That's what I'm trying to tell myself anyway to keep myself doing it, but we'll see how long it lasts. What a sick week it has been for us. I've got back to being healthy. I've smashed the gym like I've showed you and talked about multiple times now, so I'm not gonna cover that off too much anymore. We also have been to Chelsea. We went to the Roma party as well. We've had a sick week. So like I said, we could actually vlog or I could actually vlog and get enough clips for you guys. So this week has been awesome and I'm going to bring you as many vlogs as I can when we're doing things like that. So some amazing things, some incredible things. Let's move on to this. Next topic, and the reason you guys probably clicked this video is to talk about football and our football season so far. This weekend's football fixture, unfortunately, was hindered by the fact that it got cancelled or abandoned or however you want to put it. Long story short, we were 1-0 up for multiple portions of the game against second in the league. I was playing for the reserves, just got back from a knee injury if you guys didn't know, so I'm trying to get some more minutes under my belt. I just love playing football. You guys know that, or you guys should know that by now. We were 1-0 up. We were playing really, really well against second in the league. We're also going to, of course, be fighting for the title this season. I'm going to hold my hands up. I'm actually going to hold my hands up because their number 10, their striker, was actually a lot quicker than I expected. A few times he tried to get in behind. It didn't really work. I was outpacing him and outrunning him. However, on one occasion, instead of holding the ball up like he'd started to do for the rest of the game, 
He held the ball up, but instead of going back to one of his teammates, he put in a nice little spin. He burst away from me. So I was like, oh, I was so flat-footed. I wasn't ready for it. I had to chase him down. And uh, this is where it got bad for us. I put a tackle in because I thought I cannot reach him. He's going to have a free shot on goal, so I'm going to have to bring him down. I brought him down outside of the box. And I'm not just saying this. It was miles outside the box. However, the ref on this occasion gave a penalty, which was unfortunate to us. It went 1-1. But... This game was fairly heated throughout. There are a few big tackles going in and a lot of people were getting a little bit irate. Now, there was a tackle which, in my opinion, and I think majority of people's opinion, wasn't actually that bad. However, their centre-backs saw a lot to it and took a lot of offence to the tackle. And uh, he came running over and this is where the match descended into anarchy. It was full on. It, there were, I don't even know how many people were involved. But it was one of those situations where I stood back and I watched everything happen. I didn't get involved. It was none of my business. It's not my sort of area that I would ever get involved in. So I left it. I let it play out. I tried to calm down whoever I could calm down. But it escalated to a point where the ref didn't really have any other choice but to call the game off. So this weekend, our game was abandoned, which sucks for us. But it was the only option that the ref really had. It's not every day you go to a football match on a Saturday. It gets to the 75th minute and the ref calls it off because he just doesn't feel that the game can continue. So, that, like I said, it was a shame because we were 1-1 with second in the league. They're also fighting for the title. So, it was a fairly even game, fairly good game. Apart from my fault, it's the reason we conceded we could have won that game. So... As I said, it's one of those unfortunate ones. But guys, I've asked before, if you want us to start recording the clips, we have someone who will record it now. So if you want us to start recording the football, let us know in the comment section down below and we will start doing that or I'll try and start doing that for you guys to see how we are getting on Saturday. Because we also play Saturday and Sunday, but I feel like we would record the Saturday league games. But again, that's entirely up to you guys to so comment in the comment section down below. The final topic of conversation I should probably clean my desk up. It's not actually in the best state right now. That isn't actually the topic, but I had a look in the viewfinder. I saw it was a bit messy and I thought, I don't know why I'm showing you guys this. But anyway, the final topic is that videos, we've said it quite a few times now. However, Wolf has had problems with his Elgato. We should be back up and running. We should have a lot more FIFA videos coming your way, which is going to be us back together again. I'm sorry it's taken so long and we're sorry it has taken so long. However, we have filled the void as best we can in a time of crisis. I mean, it's not really a time of crisis, but that's the best label I could give it. I feel like we've done the best we possibly could. We still kept content coming your way. We've still gone and tried to do vlogs, tried to do things a little bit different. So hopefully you are enjoying the switch up of content. But like I said at the start of the video, smash the like button on this video. Comment down below. We'll interact with as many positive comments as we possibly can. Subscribe. If you are new, join the family, join the wolf pack. It'll be great to have you. I've been your boy Maverick, and until next time, I'm out.